What's up everyone? John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here. There have been rumors of an over-the-air update for the Droid X to Gingerbread. Verizon has denied that it is coming, but what appears to be the official, or going to be official, Gingerbread update to the Droid X is readily available to download and install on your Droid X without any rooting. Uh, the folks over at Droid X forums, all the instructions are going to be down below, have made it idiot proof proof positive I actually did it here uh, very very simply this gives you gingerbread it gives you the updated version of modal blur which is really welcome so if you want to check it out all links are down below let me walk you through very quickly about what you can expect on gingerbread on your droid X So first, finally, we've gotten rid of these cartoonish colors. The Droid X didn't have it, but Moto Blur definitely had. We've got sort of a new launcher at the bottom. You can put new icons in here if you like, but you can only have four. Sure, what that looks like if you hold it down, you can go ahead and drop it down there uh, if you would like. So let me go ahead and show you that this is indeed running Gingerbread, and it is running 2.3.3. You can see right there. Menu system is now white. And you get that sort of gingerbread look when you scroll to the bottom. Uh, it's not orange, you get that sort of blue color. Hopefully that's picking up on camera uh, when it gets to the very top. So I'll go ahead and hit home. There's a lot of other gingerbready things uh, that you might want to see. If you hit the home button, you're going to get your panel of icons. They can't be rearranged, but they are there. If you want to jump to one, uh, you've got that option. Uh, for me, again, the most welcome feature uh, definitely is this new launcher across the bottom. I uh, really was not a fan of the way Moto Blur had it. You now have better use of the screen real estate. The application drawer lives on the right hand side. You go ahead and uh, select an icon. That's the one actually that you can't change. So you really only have three that you can customize at the bottom. Here's what the application drawer looks like. Go ahead and go into recent. Let's go ahead and select that. And you now can jump into groups. Uh, this is sort of a gingerbread thing, but you can see it here in effect. Let's go ahead and get out of there. Let's go into all apps. Uh, as you can see, if anything new uh, is here, things look to be generally same. Uh, this is very zippy. There you can see a little blue at the bottom, hopefully. I updated this yesterday, and I've noticed a huge increase in speed, which is quite nice. Uh, other gingerbready things that you're going to see, we now have the app manager. You can manage your applications. Uh, you also have profiles, which is kind of neat. This is something that uh, Motorola is doing. Really. It's pretty standard stuff, home, work, weekend. You can go ahead and customize it any way you want. We'll go ahead and select work. It takes a minute, and it's just a blank slate. You can customize the background if you'd like. Let's take a quick look at them widgets. So we'll go into Motorola Widget. Uh, pretty standard stuff, things we've seen uh, in the past. They haven't really redone any of the widgets, unfortunately. Um, but at least you don't have to use them if you don't want to. And finally, this new dock across the bottom. So this has been a real quick sneak preview of what you can expect when you get gingerbread on your Droid X. All the instructions, again, are down below if you want to give it a shot. It is unofficial, just as a disclaimer. Uh, so if you do want to do it, be wary that you might have some warranty issues if you got to go back to Verizon. Uh, and only do this if you own the phone and you're comfortable restoring back to your original operating system should the need arise. Uh, I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo, and I'll see you in the next video.